Though, whatchamacallit? One morning, Peep, Quack, and Chirp discovered something very odd. Okay, stay behind the duck, everyone. It looks dangerous. jingle. Now I have something that makes an incredible sound. It's a, uh, uh, a whatchamacallit. What's a whatchama thing? Well, it's fascinating, at least to the, uh, smarter animals. Hmm, but what is it? It's a kind of, uh, uh thingamabob. Mm. Yeah, a very rare, very unusual to find one. Wow, can we see well, it's in my secret private treasure storage area. You'll have to walk very far and climb very high. That's okay. We were made for climbing. Let's go! Actually, they weren't made for climbing at all, but that's a minor detail. Oh, look at this place! They've ruined my organization! There we go. Come on up! I'll, um, I'll just, uh, keep an eye on things down here. Yeah. Watch and learn, Pete. Yeah. Watch and learn. <laughs>
sure, took turns sliding down the old gutter path. Oh, yeah! The raccoon, meanwhile, kept up a relentless search for the thing. You know, the hoozy what's it? Yeah. Oh, I give up. Everything slides down, but nothing slides up. That's true. You've discovered a flaw in the system. Watch. No matter how hard I try, I can't slide up. say to that raccoon. different directions. See? We have a ramp made out of a book. We have a finish line made out of a book. And we have two balls. This ball is heavy. This ball is light. And we're going to see which one wins a race. Three, two, one, zero. The wooden ball hit the finish line first. I wonder why the heavier wooden ball won the race. These are about the same weight, but one is bigger and one is smaller. I'm using a bigger ramp, and the little ball goes pretty far. I wonder why the bigger ball went further than the little ball. We are making a kind of bowling game. Go. See what happens when you play with different kinds of ramps and balls. 